think you need to keep the count on the screen. For the port calls, does that almost kill me? <laughs> If a port call us ever attacks you for game, quit TES Legends. <laughs> That'll definitely be a YouTube highlight, for sure. I told you it was OP, I mean, he still was. I actually, he played, uh, he played a port call us and Old Gate. This guy really liked uh, big old taunts, or big old guards, rather. Really big ones. <laughs> Bigger than your head. Port call us endures long after its master has perished. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, do you remember Jab from uh, DreamHack when he beat Spencer? The guy who qualified for BlizzCon? Yeah. Jab streaming Hearthstone for about eight people right now. I've made it bigger oh. than Jab. Congration. Give him a salty Damn. host. Hey, this is for beating my friend at DreamHack. <laughs> hey, that was probably a creaming. You don't want to start the day getting 3 0'd by Zoo. Are we going to hit exactly 55? No, I'm waiting for the queue time to be exactly like the estimated time. I mean, it's just an average. Yeah, the deck wasn't fantastic. It had a lot of really narrow cards. Rule number one, guys. Well, I'm not going to say rule number one. I don't have, like, a list. <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> an important... <laughs> Some quality Richard Split memes <laughs> right there. I feel like I'm just starting to talk like him. <laughs> But it's important to note how narrow the cards are you're taking. Like, is this going to be useful a lot? Or maybe not. Dude, I think this guy was in my chat yesterday. Maybe he's in my chat right now. <laughs> Hopefully not. Herbal Tea? <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't think there are that many people whose names are Herbal Tea in Let's both find out. Twitch. And... Well, he'd probably log off real quick if he was. I mean, why would he? Just so he doesn't think I'm sniping. Herbal tea is not in your chat. Alright, well, I swear he was. Or maybe he was in someone else's chat. Oh, no, he is. He's actually in my chat. Wait, no, is that not you, Herbal tea? It's X Herbal tea. Oh, shit. Damn it, Carl, he had one job. <laughs> <laughs> is it really X Herbal yeah, tea? Yeah, he said, I'll bounce, BRB. It's too late, boys. And he's the champion of the arena. Yeah. Oh, we had 60 viewers. We're just hitting all the marks. Yeah, we are. Holy shit. What did I say we'd do if we hit 100? What did I have to commit to again? No, it was nothing. No, you said you'd just buy more packs. I think you already bought the packs you committed to. Oh, yeah, shit. <laughs> Alright, well, I don't really feel like corning into nothing. Maybe it's right. It's probably not right. I got the stream in my sights. Yeah. <laughs> you should greet him, Christian. Okay. Greetings. My greetings emote isn't that cool. And then meme the audience. fuck out of them. <laughs> my hand doesn't really meme me though. It's just like a. Oh, I like her greeting. Bright moons light my path. Ooh, we got the savage. Wah! And we have no green cards to play with it. But he doesn't know that because he's definitely not in my stream still. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's killing it. Maybe he's just killing it because it's his only play. That is fair. So I guess we just play Pack Wolf, and we can buff the Tiny Wolf, and yeah. it's all good. Don't think I'll just play the 2-2 two, two over here, in case there's like a 2-2 two, two charge that I'm unaware of that he could play. I don't want it to get a favorable. I'd rather just trade evenly. Good strategizing there. Thanks. Thinking ahead, even though I don't think there's any charges in blue or green that can. No, there are there are charges in green. Well, no, there are charges, but I don't think there's a two drop, like two attack one thing. This card is really mana. good. I don't know what the fuck turn it is. What did you think it was? I don't know. Was that a fart? That was. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I kind of knew it was, but I had to be sure. So, nothing about what's happening here is good for me. I think I could just get away with... No, I don't Didn't even know. Didn't you have a buff? I thought you had a buff. I do have a buff, but it's like, then he just gets another 3-3 out of it. And then it trades favorably with the card that buffed the first thing. Oh, damn. Yes! Giant Bat, 2-2 two, two charge, with Drain, in green, 3 Magicka. Oh, nice. shit. I'm still gonna say mana if that's okay. <laughs> it's 
course not. I'm just going to be greedy and start developing over here. Although I probably should have just elixir into buff. Yeah. That's probably right. Thinking about just automaton next turn over here. I think he starts playing shit over here, though. Maybe I just buff to keep this protected. Like, the 3-3 itself isn't threatening, it's just the fact that it's really hard to trade into until later. Like, we get the 3-6 going on, and, like, that would be a great turn 4, but... Yeah, the 1-5 guy is 3, so... It was a quality yeah. move. That also makes sense, yeah. It's unlikely to matter, but what it matters is it probably really matters, because then all of a sudden you just lose this little dude. And he could do things. No. Oh. Here's that card. The hell is that card? Thank you, annoying PR for hosts. I appreciate all the hosts. I'm just draw. What the fuck just happened? I appreciate it. We'll keep you in mind in the future if I see you streaming. Uh, I don't know, man. Oh, he's drawing. He put like the little things in his deck. Yeah. All right. So there's the Hive Defender. It's a little late, but it's still good enough to play. And we will attack first. There was one game when I got this thing up to like 7 attack. It had really had enough that game. Yeah, it's important to note this is now enabled. We can draw a card with it whenever. Seems good. Yep. I agree. <laughs> I need to like host someone random uh, after I'm done streaming. Is this Spencer Swans in this call? I tried to add him like 2 hours ago. Yeah. I mean, what else could the man be doing on his Friday night? A lot of things. Herbal doesn't need a snipe because he drafted on Gollum. Dude, I drafted this... Wait, did I draft this in Arena? I don't remember. I have it in a constructed deck, but it's a lot less good because your deck's like almost twice as big. It's still really good. Shuffles uh, you, what? You shuffle three assassins in your deck that have 3-3 three, three and lethal and draw a card when you play them and they cost one. Wow. So if you start drawing them, they start chaining, and all of a sudden, he's got a very good board. He's roping. I'm gonna call him Rope T. Huh. I got a chuckle. Oh jeez. Well, goddamn. All right, so that's just going back to his hand, though, and I think that's reasonable. That thing could get huge again, but it does cost six if he wants to do that again, or it could just go for my face. We drew another cut purse. It doesn't give it any toughness. So I want to put something in there that I can trade with, I suppose. It's probably just the draw card. I think I just attack first, though. And see what's good with all of that. Because I'm not going to use my buff this turn, it doesn't matter. I'm just going to play my cut person set up for future turns. Yeah. I think the bonuses are just based on the level up rewards. Waffle. So like certain yeah. cards in your class will upgrade before others. Yeah. Like since I chose the fire and water, or no, I chose the high elf, so I'm water and light. So all my water and light cards are going to upgrade before all my fire, nature, and darkness ones. And oh wait, no, no, not, no. That's not what they're called at all, so... <laughs> yeah, this card just says, uh, draw a card if an enemy mirror has been destroyed this game. It doesn't draw a card when one's destroyed. So, I mean, since one had been destroyed... I didn't want to draw beforehand, because if it was a prophecy that dealt two damage, this is, like, the best target. And I need this over there to take that trade. So I think that was the correct order. And, it's like, if, really if it would have changed my attack, then you draw first, but I don't think anything changes my attack there. Endurance, intelligence, willpower, like, they're just mouthfuls. Yeah... Gotta be a better way to call these things. This card is scary. Like, I want to play this Renegade, but he has the huge weapon that gives, like, plus six, plus zero, and he can literally trade with anything using it. This card has a lot of value. Herbal T's about to burn the shit out of you. Five drop and eight drop. I can play Guard. I suppose that's good. Yeah, it's good. Where do I play this thing, though? I guess I play it over here in case he develops over here, but then... No one's really posting deck lists, annoying. Like, it's just kind of... 
We will be on BetweenTheLanes.com. Yeah. James65807, hi, man. Yeah. How's it going? Yeah, we'll get there. Give us a week to just kind of get used to the ladder and kind of grind some games, but no one's really posting deck lists as it stands currently. That being said, it's only been an open... <laughs> an open closed I know. beta for I noticed the past that. 48 hours. So. Well, if you're up, there are only like 1% of people who had expensive decks. Yeah. Well, it's, it's the third day now, right? Yeah. I think I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna build some good ship, but I mean, I need to craft some things. I could I could have like a couple expensive decks right now, but I just didn't craft the legendaries with my things yet. So like, he takes this trade, he buffs... Wait, no, he can't buff and trade. Yeah, this is good. I think this is good. Yeah, this is the third day of the NDA being lifted. Yeah, there is a site just dedicated to deck lists. Mine will not be, uh... You can post that link because it looks like a helpful site, but also I will post... <laughs> you hear TempoStorm.com with some ducks up? Please, no. But they do have a great Hearthstone writer named CVH. Who writes weekly strategy articles for TempoStorm. This is a pretty intense battle. And if the pairing is still the same as it is in Hearthstone, we're both one and one, so we don't want to take the second loss yet. Hmm. I guess they're being a little. Oh, he has the Wamasu. Oh, so God. good. What's it targeting? At least it only kills a 2 2. Ooh, I got my Javelin. That's a good one. It is. And I can draw a card this turn with my 4-6. Which I like. So I'll do it first. Even. Quality plays. Even trade. Then I think I just Javelin and I also frenzied up my 1-1. One -one. Just so I can trade with a 3-2. Two, two. I don't yeah. want to bust a room. Yeah. It's a really clean turn. It's not like a javelin I'm particularly happy about. But I'm also not unhappy about it. Yeah. <laughs> Bunch of rated nerds. Yeah, I've been writing for Tempo Storm for like a little over a year now. As a strat, like probably the longest standing Hearthstone strategy writer they've had. I'm just not rostered, so people don't know me like compared to Hyped or Gara. But I'm in a Skype chat with all of them. They never talk really. In fact, I don't ever check that Skype chat. Making it sound like we're bros. Gara only logs on to complain about shit every now and then. Yep. What do I do? No, Gara. Like Gara of the Sand. He's a Hearthstone player too. Oh. In oh, addition Christ. to killing people with sand, he also plays Hearthstone. <laughs> Please! Oh, it steals damage to me. That's fine. Right. <laughs> she just... <laughs> she just requests that card not to kick your ass. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm Please. not gonna... I'd rather not. Ragnaros! Free! <laughs> so we can steal keywords, which is irrelevant right now, because there's nothing to steal. I think we just play the Forefront on this side, the Automaton on this side, after we attack. I wish I could kill that. Can't. Would be nice. I don't think it's nibble ally time. We're still pretty high on life, like we're in the, the race. Pan. Okay. Oh, we do bust two runes, I don't really care. This is a bad amount of damage to be doing this turn, I think. Like, the thing about it in this game is, you gotta think, getting ahead is usually kinda risky in a game. Cause like, yeah, they have card advantage and they're just gonna come back and once you stabilize they can't really do anything, but they still have to win the game. Like, as long as we never get irreparably hard, far behind and play the, the lanes smart, like the prophecy cards or just the card advantage we can get again will help us out. Uh, the card choice between card upgrades is permanent, but you can still pull both the upgraded cards. Like, they both yeah, exist in the collection. Awful. Yeah, but like, if you open a lot of packs, you could, like... Now I did the upgrades finally after I opened a bunch of packs, so it's like you can upgrade between this which you own three of already or this which you own three of already, so it's not really relevant. Like you can you can just craft them right in. It's just for free to play players who like never buy any packs, like it'll help them out somewhat and encourage them to play more. So it's a good system. But not super relevant if you also like get a bunch of packs over the course of however long.
snake tooth necklace, so it has drain now. That's pretty good. A lot of things are transpiring. He cursed the shit out of my guys. Which I guess cost him cards. You better deal with that drain. I can take the drain with my Anasi. <laughs> That's a real thing. Yeah. I can just play my entire hand too. I can't take the buff though, so I can't kill it, which is fine, I think. Taking the drain away is important though. So I have drain now. Oh, nimble allied. Where do I deploy you? I think just on the left. I try to kill him on the left now. He takes a favorable here, but I don't really care. Oh, I didn't get the buff. Feels bad, man. Be better. I mean, I'm trying. <laughs> sure. I try so hard. That's such a relevant buff well, too, because now I just don't have. Like, you have to top deck a damage. I know. That's because yeah, that's what I was about to say. Point. Like that was a relevant coin flip there. Oh, never mind. All right, so he had ways to interact with the board. It's fine. We weren't going to just totally get him. Yeah, he's got a hand of eight. But I mean, I'd rather be in my position than his until he plays something insane. He's ramping up to eleven this turn. That's scary. What just happened? Oh, oh yeah, he's deflecting. Oh, wait, no, he's not ramping. What's wrong with me? I'm just slow. The deflection is happening. I read chat and I got distracted. I always blame chat. It's another one of the rules. <laughs> Even if you're not a streamer. Alright, I might be heading off soon too. It's been like four and a half hours. I'm tired. What time is it? <sighs> Hanging out yeah, with you stream bugs like has one. been sweet though. Yeah, you guys are awesome. I like relevant streams. If you guys want to be even more awesome, feel free to drop a follow so you can hang out with us all the time. So much ward is happening. He doesn't even really need to do that. He can just give that ward, but yeah. All right. So I'm just going <laughs> to... James says your cartoon profile is cool. Oh, thanks, man. I made that a long time ago. Yeah. That was better for, like, draw for turn, actually. All I can think of is Tom Rogers. The game, thank you for the follow. We get him down to five, we pop his last rune, we play this horrible top deck in the right lane. Jeez. I can't really express how bad of a draw that was. I think it's just the worst. Hit face hard, yeah. Yeah, we can't, like, yeah. trading here, just... I don't think it does anything for us. Any other draw would be better, though, like, we could actually set up a clock here. We know one of his cards is the giant weapon, so that doesn't matter. The elixir doesn't really matter if he can't trade. Which you can do over here, obviously, but the cards in this lane are just lost. Thank you for the follow, James. Oh, please don't draw it. Well, a Firebolt's not the most relevant card ever, because these, well... Yeah, okay, so he didn't get it anyway, that's good. It means he actually has to waste attacks on these. And we have, like, a lot of health to work with. Health is card advantage, really, because we're going to be able to have extra time to not die. Runa. But he's not taking these trades lightly. He's keeping everything full. Wasn't even really, like, required. If he had a guard, he could have like played a guard and given it a uh, ward. Whoa, there's the lurcher. That card makes an impact when you play it, man. Alright, that's a more reasonable draw than the last one. Why did I think I'd get him to 5 last turn? Ugh. Gaining that one life. Put this over here just in case I draw like two damage, because he can take that trade, then that trade, then I have this one attack minion out, which if this was anything else, I'd probably go to one. I don't know. We're drawing like kind of weak stuff. We need damage, man. We need damage. We just need two more. He needs to give me some prophecies, man. I actually don't have many prophecies in this deck, honestly. But hey, Ragey Ragers, check out your tier list. Yeah. 
Thanks for checking out the site, Ragey Rage. Meta yes, strategy. It is meta strategy for versus arena. No, I mean, what if you mean what is the meta strategy? It's kind of hard. It's to basically tell. like what picks are better over others. Well, it's just like a, a pretty crass value rating. Like it's not going to tell you exactly where you're going to be, like playing against. I actually don't. I haven't played yeah, enough myself just, to know just to what. Just give you an idea of the cards to look are. out for. Yeah. I'm sure after like ten arenas or so, you could start figuring out which are the the slightly weaker, uh, you know, colors that you want to be in, etc. What they do, benefits. I mean, we know some lists of the like benefits. That, I mean, lists like the one you just created helped me a lot when I was first getting into Har Harston, yeah. like learning what the good cards were. Yeah. I if at any point he has a guard, we're very sad. Ooh! Carl! Do you see it, Carl? You did it. Where do I put it? Have both these attacked? Uh. It's tough to say. <laughs> In case he plays a guard, he can't play one in both lanes. Yeah, they both attacked. Those aren't guards, Carl. That's just lethal. Yeah, you got him. Oh. By the you egg. Fucking sh 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 shield. Woo! See the prophecies, guys. <laughs> yeah, you have to respect the tempo swing and sometimes just the lethal that the prophecies can give you. Don't underestimate how powerful that card is. Even you don't think your deck is defensive. But, like, you need that extra push. Got a couple prophecy cards in there. They're gonna get broken eventually, right? Like, that's a chance, man. It's a chance. That was a sick win. Good game, Herbal Tea. By the egg. Yes. 